Hello, this is Scott, and this is the Hype Report. Here are the quotes for various items. First, EU referendum. The campaign to take Britain out of the EU has opened a remarkable 10-point lead. If the EU goes, it may not be long before Germany goes for the exit. Of course, don't be surprised at the dead vote to stay in the EU. Next, Islamic terrorism hits Florida. What would be the repercussions be since a suicide vest wearing 20-something year old Islamic terrorist killed 20 and injured 42 in a Florida gay bar before being killed in a police shootout? And Obama wants more of these peaceful, fun-loving people to enter a country of a lot of sitting ducks. Yet another reason for the Second Amendment. Next, food stamps. For eight days, the J.P. Morgan administered electronic benefits transfer cards have been having glitches. These EBIT cards are the modern equivalent of the bread lines of the 1930s. If the EBITs were to be shut off on a widespread basis, it is a certainty that horrific riots would result in a short amount of time. This is another reason to get prepared. Speaking of being prepared... Next, PrEP. Something is coming. The U.S. government has issued two warnings to PrEP. First, it was Obama. Then, the Department of Homeland Insecurity followed with a warning about potential evacuations in Washington, D.C. These are interesting times, folks. Next, Hillary launders money? Well, according to Larry Nichols, it appears that Hillary Clinton has been more than baking cookies and violating national security with her emails. She apparently has been laundering drug money as well. <laughs> Next thing you know, she'll be associated with a pedophile ring. <laughs> Wait, Bill already has that covered. What difference at this point does it make? Next, PC market. PC shipments have declined 7.3% year over year. One of the main reasons is that people are availing themselves for the free Windows 10 spyware OS. Of course, at some point, the PC is doing all that the user wants, so why buy a new one? Next, seven reasons chemotherapy fails. Without in-depth reasons, here are a few. One, chemotherapy literally destroys good gut bacteria, the biological seat of immunity for the human body. Two, chemotherapy is a mixture of toxic chemicals that cause cancer, so the treatment itself is a culprit for the disease being treated. Three, chemotherapy is mostly administered in hospitals where superbugs are rampant. Finally, please prepare now for the escalating economic and social unrest. Good day.